hello guys habibi here in this video i'm going to show you how to create snake animation in 3d max and export it or import it into unity all right on my previous video i was i was showing you how to animate snake object which is here a simple cylinder and let's see can we export it to unity and use it here or not based on my experience this path deform modifier is useless if we want to export the snick animation to unity because it's not working let me show you let me just right click on this object yeah let me select this cylinder object it has this path deform modifier with it and it has this such animation eh? let me export this selected object to my unity directory project directory yeah, it is here let me browse my folder copy and I'm going to export the 3d object there animated snake one okay and here we have this 3d object fbx file and we can drag and drop it here and this is our camera and let's play the unity game and let's see it is not working it's not moving it has animation in it and let me see it has no keyframe at all can see that it has this take one but it has no animation no keyframe I don't know why we can why can we export the animated snake that we have made here in unity uh, in 3d max to unity I will show you what is the correct way to create snake animation or something like that in 3d max and export it to unity let me check again here you have this window if you click play it is only zero frame minute you cannot play it let me check again if I can play around with the export option here export selected yes and here geometry animation we check the animation extra option use scene name remove single key big animation <coughs> I was trying to use this big animation feature but it is not working for this path deform modifier I don't know why and I was searching around on the internet and I didn't find an answer. We cannot pick animation using this path deform modifier. Just let's try again here. Uh, let me check the other options. Okay, I have already checked this pick animation option and click OK. Now if I go back to Unity what I can see here is only zero frame animation it is useless we cannot play this snake animation okay that's why I make this video tutorial is uh, this one is about how to create snake animation that we can use it in unity just forget the, this path deform modifier and we will use 
bone instead this is my snake object let me place it here go to top view let me the rotation okay I have this snake object and let me add bones for it here go to this gear icon bones one two three four just like this and we add skin modifier to the cylinder skin then we add all the bones here now we, we can if we move the bone the snake will also moving all right the next thing is to we have these four bones right I need to unparent them like this okay now we will work on the bone one first we go to animation constraint path constraint we click the line and if we animate if we, if we play this timeline you can see the that first bone is moving like this and we need to go to this checkbox check this follow checkbox and bang okay uncheck the flip it is moving like this that is for the first bone now what we need to do is to set the same thing with the rest of the bones animation uh, constraints path constraints we check the follow bang and we change it to z x y or y yeah y not z but we need to change the percentage of this long path something like this you can see that the formation is not nice enough because I had so few bones if you want to make it more detail you need to add more bones to the snake object let it be like that and let me do the the third bone animation oh no. animation constraint path constraint and we check the follow bang and y and we change the percentage
I don't know do we need to do we need this last spoon or not let me just delete it and everything is fine the snake is moving I know it is not really good but that is what I did previously I can see the snake is somehow twisted here it is because the snake has low resolution mm. and uh, let's what if I add another modifier to this like to this cylinder like smooth modifier or turbo smooth turbo smooth oh oh yeah something like that guys but as I said because I have only three bones here the deformation is not really smooth but you can do some trick for example make the path more s smoother like this okay guys now this snake object is moving along this path now by using this method of uh, animating snake in 3d max we can export the object guys and let's try to yeah click this cylinder export export selected and I will name it animated snake 2 save okay and just click ok here now if we go back to unity we have this animated snake 2 we place it here and let's play the the scene it is not moving I know but at least we have this animation we have oh hang on I forgot something export export selected animation yep big animation I think deformation skin morph I don't know let's go back yeah we have this animation now in your unity while the first object it has no animation we cannot play it even we check the big checkbox let me go to play the scene yeah it is not Played because we need animation controller on this object it is here let me add an animation controller just this animation make transition empty this one I will use tick one of the animation animated snake to FBX double click make 
get the loop variable loop time click apply and let's play it ah I did not add the animation control to the object guys okay let's try again okay you see that we have this animated snake working and moving in this unity editor all right guys thank you for watching this tutorial i hope it can be useful to you bye bye see you next time